Jones, uh, you brought a different energy tonight. You played well alongside Terrence. Um, what did you see out there that allow you to just kind of play free? Because I know they've been missing that pace, and you, it seemed like you brought the energy and effort tonight. Um, you know, credit to my, you know, my teammates, the coaches. You know, uh, telling me to stick with it. You know, and uh, but tonight, man, was a great night. Just coming out, I just wanted to play with the pace and just keep the game, uh, just keep the pace up. Coming in and just try to change the momentum of the game. Got you. And uh, watching from the sidelines, obviously you haven't played in a few games. Do you feel like you've learned something kind of watching from the sidelines? Yeah, of course. Uh, you know, just being a, you know, there for my teammates, being uh, present, even though if I'm not playing, if I'm playing, just you know, keeping the same energy. And uh, you know, when it's my time, my numbers cause God there, I give it my all. So it was an amazing game tonight. Bones, at the th third quarter, there was a 12 to two run in which you're personally responsible for nine of them. Uh, two three pointer and an assist. What what did what did that feel like? What's the mindset feel like on the court during that run for you? You definitely got a little emotional at the timeout. What, yeah. what did it feel like? Just trying to be the you know the spark bunny man. Just come in and just change the dynamic of the game, change the flow, change the pace, and uh, just give the defense a different look. And uh, I feel like that's what we did tonight. And uh, just go out there and just play to my strengths. You had some real strength with the bench plus Kawhi lineups tonight. What, what was working about that? Uh, just sharing the ball, and um, you know, we always, uh, you know, priest in the locker room, just getting back to the second side. If the one, the first guy don't got it, you know, get to the second side and keep playing, and uh, get everybody involved. And if you don't have it, so that's something we, you know, pinpointed tonight. Bones, we always talk about your energy, but another guy who brings that is Russ. Uh, yeah, you guys had a lot of fun moments out there, tonight, yeah. especially that lob. What's it like being one playing with him, but then two learning from him? Man, um, everything, man. He's a you know first battle Hall of Famer. Uh, got so much love and just you know uh, just everything for us, man. I love you know watching him play. His energy. Uh, he goes out there and he plays 99% every time and uh, 100%, 100% every time. Man, he gives it his all. Uh, so man, just being alongside Russ, I learned so much. And um, you know he always in my area telling me, you know, the good things, you know, what to, what do you see out there for me? So, you know, I'm glad to, you know, be a teammate uh, alongside of Russ. Hey, Burns, what do you think was the team's collective mindset and approach with playing without PG and, and what do you think is the key for a level team that moving forward? Um, just uh, next man up, uh, you know, just guys who haven't been playing, like myself, just come in and just try to, you know, be that guy to uh, provide a spark and just come in and just, you know, uh, contribute to winning. So, you know, PG went down, you know, it's a sad moment, but, you know, PG would be back out there with us, but, you know, we got to handle business on the floor and just, you know, keep tallying wins for PG. One more? Uh, two minutes? Okay. Sorry, I'm sorry if you were asked this, but you have been playing uh, coming into this game. Uh, what's that stay ready mentality like? What was the conversation like to, hey, your name's gonna be called today. Yeah. Um, you know, it's, we 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 go by the when we uh the guys who don't play, we we go by stay ready game, and uh, that's what we've been doing, playing those games, just staying sharp. Uh, the coaches have been helping me with that. You know, the teammates, uh, Roko, uh, Mir. You know, I've been playing with those guys. So just coming, you know, coming into this game, I felt like I was ready. You know, the coaches had helped me, so you know, it's just been an amazing moment out there. Has the communication been been uh, here liking what you wanted? Yeah, of course, man. Like even though I'm not playing the communication at a high level, you know, that's something that I love, man. If it's, you know, I'm playing or I'm not, you know, communication is everything, and I, I'm definitely thankful for that. Bones, uh, you were on the floor quite a bit with Kawhi tonight. Um, what's it like, personally, as you're watching him, kind of have the game that he's having tonight? Like, like what? What's the feeling? Yeah, um, just seeing how he you know controls the game, makes shots at a high level, um, and when the guy's open, he always hits them too. So, you know, Kawhi can, you know, he can take a game over and get his teammates involved. You know, when we need Kawhi to step up, he, he's always present. Yeah. 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 Did you call yourself a spark bunny? Yeah. <laughs> Let's get ready for Hoop Jab.